Welcome to Michael and Games, and welcome back to Spin Tires. So in this episode, it was kind of subscriber requested. One of the vehicles I couldn't really get, but uh. So anyways, we're gonna be testing out the Ford Raptor, which is one of the vehicles that you know my subscriber wanted to have me check out. And then this BTR, I just felt like it because it's a freaking BTR. So let's uh, start up the engine here. There we go. Oh, that thing sounds awesome. All right, let's straighten out the wheels or turn them that way. All right, parking brake is off. And let's just get off on the road and see what this thing can handle. Uh, eventually, I'm gonna try towing with it. I'm gonna try and tow the APC, basically. Okay, so I do have that new mod installed that if you didn't see yesterday's video, it's a how to install mods, basically, video. And uh, I installed this mod that basically changes how the dirt handles. So let's activate four wheel drive. There we go, no problem at all now. But the dirt does seem to deform a lot more than it used to. Oh man, there we go. Now with this truck, you can only change the wheels. There's like four different kinds. Two of them are similar. I don't really like the Rockstar wheels. I think they, they're just cheesy. You know, those the, you've seen them probably around you. Like almost every Jeep has them. Jeep JKs, sorry. Most Jeep JKs have them. There's a big star in the middle. Yeah, they're really tacky looking, honestly. But I think this truck looks really good. It moves really quick, too. Whoop. I hit a rock there. Okay, there's another rock there. Come on, baby. Right, let's try and climb up the hill. I'll put it in two-wheel drive to see if we can do that. Again, I do not have diff lock engaged. Right, so we are actually spinning right now. I'm right, turning four-wheel off. Try, try and get up there. No, no. See, if I had diff lock on, which I could do diff lock on, just to see if that'll work alone. Which is doing a pretty good job. Okay, we're stuck now. Let's activate four wheel drive. Let's climb up this hill. Uh, we'll do diff lock off. Let's see how this is. Oh, we're sliding a little bit there. All right, there we go. And again, if you guys want me to check out another vehicle, you know, let me know in the comments. All right, we're coming up to this watering hole now. Come on, baby, floor it, floor it. We are not moving that quick. Okay. Damn, and then the water textures too. It changed them up a bit. Man, that looks so cool. Let, let me know what you guys think in the comments. I think right now we'll go switch over to the BTR and see how that thing handles. All right, here's the BTR. Let's start up this engine. Oh yeah, rolling cold. Yeah. Yeah, it's rolling cold. Got parking brake on and disengage parking brake. There we go. And now uh, it says diff lock is always on. Uh, we do not have four wheel drive on or all wheel drive. This is uh, eight wheel drive technically. So it looks like it is rear wheel drive, two axles in the back. Let's activate four-wheel drive or all-wheel drive, whatever you want to call it. Okay, now we got all eight wheels moving. This thing should be basically the most capable vehicle in the game. Now, in the real life, I believe these things can float on water. I'm not 100% sure, maybe only some of them. But we'll try that in a moment. Let's just smash through this here. Oh, let's get those headlights on. Oh, that is sick looking. And then we'll check out the mods that you can do to this thing as well. I forgot to do that. My bad. All right, so this thing is not moving too quick, but it moves through the water no problem. All right, so let's go over to that big pond and see if this thing actually floats or not. All right, I got four-wheel drive off. We're going to head into the water now, see if this thing actually floats or not. Here we go. And... Damn, this is actually not too deep. Wait, here we go. Here we go. Is it floating? I don't know if this is actually deep enough for it to float. Let me turn on four-wheel drive. I was not expecting that. I thought this was a little deeper than it really is. Um, let's see. Yeah, this thing is not deep enough, I think, for this thing to float. So I'm pretty sure it's got to be up to that level right above the wheels, right up here, for it to float. I don't know if it does, though. Does not look like it does float. Okay. It might not. I have no idea how this game works. And this is a mod after all. But it does not. Okay, we are starting to dig into the ground underneath the water. So 
starting to sink a bit. It doesn't look like it floats, actually. Which is kind of disappointing, but, you know, it's not a big deal. It's a mod. Alright, so let's see what kind of mods we can add on to this thing. We got tools. Alright, what did that actually add on? I don't see anything. Hold on a second. Okay, so something on the back, it looks like. Uh, this thing right here. Not really sure what that is, but apparently it's tools. Oh, okay, there we go. We got an axe, a shovel. Not sure. Oh, I guess to cut down a tree or something? Okay. Uh, we got soldier. Okay, so it looks like we can add some soldiers to the top. That's pretty badass. They actually got guns, too. They got AKs. That is pretty freaking cool. Alright, uh, come on. Back out there. Um, backup wheel. Okay, whoop. Alright, let's check that out. So we got a wheel on top there that's covered. That's pretty cool. And tow lines. Oh, that's pretty cool. Right up in front there. That is pretty sick. Okay, and then it looks like we can change the wheels as well. So let's see. We got the default wheels on, of course. Let's change them to type 2. Okay, uh, I don't really see that big of a difference, actually. Right, so it looks like they're the same tire, but different wheels. Then what about type 3? Okay, this changes everything. Um, I'm thinking probably type 1, or the default is the best, honestly. I think the default looks the coolest. Alright, let's start up the engine. Oh, that looks so good. Parking brake off. Let's just go drive around really quick, see what it looks like with the soldiers on top. It is really badass looking. Alright, this is such a cool looking mod. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I do want to hear from you. you know, give me your suggestions or opinions. Uh, four wheel drive will leave on. Damn. Oh, he's got a machine gun on the back too. That's pretty badass. Alright, so what we're going to do now is switch over to the other vehicle. And then we'll try and tow this thing. Uh, what I'm probably going to have to do, though, is respawn it so it doesn't have any fuel and see if I can actually pull it with no fuel. All right, guys, we're in the Ford Raptor now. We're going to get around here. We actually got another BTR. This one has no fuel in it, so we're going to try and tow it. Uh, I'm going to activate diff lock because with the mod I installed yesterday, you start to actually dig into the ground and you can actually get yourself stuck, which was kind of difficult to get stuck with the vanilla game but that new mod I installed really changes how the dirt handles. It's really cool, I think. All right, let's get around here, and can we tow it? Yes, I uh, will hook it up to there. All right, let's see, can we tow this BTR? Starting engine out of fuel. It's not even gonna move, damn. Uh, let me switch to it, make sure there's not a parking brake on it. Parking brake is on. Let me turn that off and see if it changes. Try that again. And... Nope. Okay, it does not look like we're able to pull it at all. Oh, wait. Wait. Come on, baby. Come on. Nope. Okay. Uh, if I switched... Oh, now it's moving backwards. This thing weighs a freaking ton. Actually, more like probably seven tons. Um... Let me switch to this and let's see if no the winch the winch is not doing anything I can't pull forward so the Ford Raptor cannot tow a BTR I could have probably guessed that to start with but um yeah okay all right guys I'm gonna leave this video here I hope you liked it if so please do hit that like button it really does help me out when you do maybe consider subscribing if you haven't already have a great day guys and see you next time